Hi, this is Tamiko with Pages, Pumps, and Pine. I'm here with an unboxing of my latest Planners Anonymous kit. This kit is called Butterfly Skies. Now, this has everything that is all me. I love butterflies. My favorite color is purple. One of my um, favorite flowers are orchids. And all of that is in this kit. And the meaning behind the kit, pretty much embracing your true self, um, loving yourself, all of that just speaks volumes. And every time we would get a sneak peek of this kit, I would get emotional watching other people unbox it. I got emotional. It just, I, I am in love with it. All right, so let's just dig in. <laughs> Take everything out of the box. Alrighty. Let's move some stuff around. We'll come back to that stuff. Y'all, this is a very beautiful kit. Packed by Amadika. this. Alright. Like my washi tape got a little crushed. There we go. Okay. So here is, let me zoom in. Here is our um, welcome card. It says sometimes you have to face the darkness to become who you really are and you truly are amazing. Renee. So there's Renee. That gives you an idea of the color palette of this kit. It is absolutely stunning, y'all. Um, I want to read that again. Sometimes you have to face the darkness to become who you really are. And you truly are amazing. So we've all been through some things. Um, but this kit is really about embracing yourself. It says, thank you so much for purchasing our latest kit, Butterfly Skies. This kit is about celebrating your inner you, your true self. We should never be afraid of showing who we truly are because we are amazing. Be your gorgeous self and shine. And it goes on to tell you everything that's in the kit and gives you the website because um, when you are a subscriber, you do have access to some free printables. So, um, gives you the information for that. But yeah, this, I always say that, oh my God, I love this kit, I love this kit. But this one resonates so much with me. This one and the note to self. Um, and of course, I love the Planner Babe kit because it had the peonies. And peonies are my absolute favorite flower. Um, I'm not as much in love with pink as I am purple but this kit has some of every single thing that I love the purple the orchids and the butterflies it is just stunning y'all stunning kit all right let's see let's dig into the pen here so here's the pen it's got this beautiful blue and then look at those crystals y'all look and it has silver hardware Look at those crystals. O-M-G. Beautiful. Beautiful. Love it. Love it. All right, here are the quote cards. And then here's the backing card there, which is like one of the paper sauce. Oh, I'm going to be doing a lot of sighing <laughs> because this kit really, really, it does something to me. I don't know. It's like from everything that she's shown, I just get emotional. Like, I don't know why. But anyways, okay. So we have eat, sleep, wake up, beautiful. You do you. And the colors. Oh my God, the colors. I hope they're resonating on 
screen like they are in person. Beautiful changes happen in the darkest of times. Ugh. What if you fly? Ugh. Never hide your true self. So those are the quote cards. Love these quote cards. Oh my gosh. I'm going to just... I'm already in love with this kit. Like seriously. Um, This was our mystery item for the month. So this mystery item was a kind of like a journaling book. Okay. And it has different prompts in it. And I'm not one to really journal. <laughs> like, it's not something that I can really stick to. It's very difficult for me. Um, but yeah, it has these little prompts. Okay. And then she included additional sticker sheets. So we got two additional sticker sheets. Y'all, look at these butterflies. <sighs> um... It has the little hearts. The colors are just absolutely beautiful. And then it has these little word stickers for you to put in here. So like here it says three words to describe myself. And I could go from this lip, this uh, sticker sheet here and maybe find three words or what have you. Um, yeah, I... I love this like I look at those butterflies it's so beautiful um I know the botanical gardens in um, Atlanta there's this section with a lot of butterflies and it's just stunning so I mean and I love that this has the black because those colors just pop off of there <sighs> Yeah. All right. Here's the stamps. I'm going to open these up so you can get a good look at these. So the way that she did the stamps was so that you could layer the butterflies. So like you could do a backing color and then this could be like in a different color and then you can put um, this over top and maybe another color. So yeah, I'm excited about this. Then you've got the orchids. Oh my gosh, orchids. Next to peonies, orchids are my favorite. Okay. <laughs> it's the peonies and it's the orchids. And I love dahlias and dahlias were in the last kit. So she has used some of my favorite florals in her kit. Um, magnolias are another one that I like, and those were in the note to self kit. So yeah, then we have this as worthy, loved, amazing, beautiful. You have a heart, you have some foliage there. I am strong, I am smart, I am kind. So you can kind of mix up those words. And there's Renee. There's a little tiny, tiny butterfly there. It says me. This is what's crazy. She put out a request post on in the Facebook group and for us to request different um, kit ideas. And that was the first thing that that was actually the only thing that I suggested was a butterfly kit. The fact that they came out with the butterfly kit with the purples and the orchids. Like, I couldn't have asked for more. I love this. I love this. Did I say that I love this? Because I love this. So those are the stamps. Let's look at these die cuts because they are absolutely gorgeous. Okay? Gorgeous. Wait till you see the art card. This art card is so getting framed. It is getting framed. Okay. That little tiny butterfly. So look, this is, this is the most beautiful card. Look at it. With brave wings, you will fly. And it goes through the life cycle 
of the butterfly. That is beautiful. Look at it, y'all. That is the most beautiful thing. And then you've got this ombre color. And I don't know if you can see the faint wording on the back of that. I am worthy. I am amazing. Oh, I love it. I am loved. I am unique. Oh my gosh. Just beautiful. This is probably my favorite art card. And I thought I've come across some other ones that were my favorite. This is my favorite art card. This is definitely going in a frame. Definitely. All right. So let's look at the die cuts. We have this beautiful octagonal wreath. I think that's an octagon. Looks eight sides. Um, so it's got the foliage going on and the butterflies too. Stunning. There's Renee. You always get the girl or guy of the month as a die cut as well. Here's that little teeny tiny butterflies. That is so cute. We have amazing, oh, the purples. Oh, goodness. Look at the orchid. Look at the detail in the orchid. Look at the detail. <sighs> yeah. Oh, man. This kit makes me emotional. Look at that. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. I am in love. So in love. Let's do this. Here's another beautiful orchid. Here we have a purse. Look, it has a little Planners Anonymous thing on there. That's cute. Look at the butterfly. Look at the butterfly. <sighs> and then you have a vase with the orchids. Oh my gosh. So, okay, I'm just trying to stop making noises, but it's just so breathtaking like oh my goodness it says growth through what you go through and then the foliage look at those i think these are fern leaves look at those even that is stunning and look at the color it just pops oh my god and then this little die cut sits beautiful and here we have like some headphones You've got a little plant. This is the cutest little thing to me. Like, it's just so cute. And so, it's just drawn so cute. I love it. And then this says, I am unapologetically unapolog me. We've got another beautiful butterfly. This one has some pinks in it. Oh, man. Then another stunning butterfly. And then you have a camera. I love these die cuts. This alone is like, hello, beautiful. I love the octagons. I love that touch. I love that it's not just a circle. Oh man. Mm, mm. That art card, y'all, that art. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Beautiful, just beautiful. All right, so those are the die cuts. Then we have the standard stickers. You get four sheets of standard stickers. If you want additional stickers, there is an add-on that you can get. Um, here's the first sheet of stickers. There's Renee, some beautiful butterflies. There's the... Uh, caterpillar there another caterpillar i love this like little washi strip here that cute chair i love this and there's some more little tiny butterflies look y'all there's a teeny tiny little butterfly over here like, teeny tiny and then oh this is just so this plant is just stinking cute to me and i love it in that octagon there that octagon frame look at that oh my god this looks like a little pen case. That's what that is. A little pen case. And then you have like the stack of um, file boxes. 
books. I love this color palette. Oh my gosh. I just love it. Look at that. Oh. And then you always get this icon sheet that has all of the colors of the kit. Sticky notes, coffee cups, glasses, cell phone, watercolor splash, planner knowledge, that's a live package, happy mail, and traveler's notebook. Then you get one set of day covers for one week. You get a sticker representing the current kit and then a sticker representing the next kit. And the next kit is called Under the Stars. Now, this kit is um, a nod to an old Planners Anonymous kit, the Under the Stars. And I wasn't really feeling the old kit. I wasn't, you know, a subscriber back then, but I've seen that kit. And so I was like, I don't think I'm going to want to get this one, but it's beautiful. And what really struck me, first off, is the woman with the dark hair. I love that. And then we got some yay stickers, and you always get this foldable traveler's notebook stickers, which are usually sneak peeks of a traveler's notebook if they were to make one. <laughs> so... That's what that would look like. I'm praying they don't make this because then I will be tempted to buy. So don't make it. Don't do it, Sammy. <laughs> I can't buy another planner. So don't do it. All right. So those are the standard stickers. And then we're going to look at some washi. Let's look at some washi. Right, so since I have this one in my hand, we'll start with y'all. I'm warning you now, the washi is absolutely beautiful. Like, <sighs> how many times have I sighed in this video already? Like a million times already. Oh my gosh, this. Y'all, look at this washi. Look at that. And it's got um, a very light, hollow boiling on it I don't know if you can tell but oh my gosh look at that washi tape oh man how does she do it I don't know it's stunning stunning all right here's the next one I thought I felt the start of it And there's this one with those beautiful orchids and the foliage. And then this also has that hollow foiling on the butterflies. And then tiny foiling on the center of the um, orchids. Oh my gosh. Just ah, stunning, stunning, stunning. And then this one is like a printed one that is ombre and then it has that hollow foiling on it as well so you can see the ombre color and then you can see the foiling oh goodness gracious help us beautiful this I don't even know what to say about this and if you want it you could even cut this washi because it's got this white background you can cut it like they had the raindrop washi before and you can just cut the out the individual um butterflies because before I cut out like the individual raindrops and made it look like it was raining so yeah those are the three washi tapes beautiful all right so that is everything in the standard kit okay so whoops i take that back that's not everything i forgot the paper let's see so here's the standard papers we look at those and then we'll go into the the zoom out so you can get a better look at all the paper. 
I definitely want to make a shaker something with this acet uh, acetate because it is stunning. Look at that. Oh my gosh. And then it's hollow on this side. And I think it's just silver on the back, if I'm not mistaken. Of course, no, I think it's hollow on the back too. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. Just stunning. And then here's the vellum. Beautiful. Look at those. It's just. There are no words, y'all. There just are no words. Okay. And then look at this one. It's nothing but foliage, but look how pretty it is. Look at the colors pop. Look at that green popping off of the air. Oh, and then this is the color that's on the back. So you get six papers. You get three different ones, two of each, so that you can use the printed side without compromising and not having it. I mean, so you can use the plain side without compromising the printed side. So you have one of each uh, two of each sorry okay and then here's the next paper with those beautiful words with that dark background and then that purple on the back oh, stunning papers man and then this one with all the beautiful butterflies and then you have that dark background on that so those are the standard papers you always get a, um, a vellum and an acetate and then th the other papers, okay? So now let's look at the add-ons. So there's a sticker add-on and there's a paper add-on. And since we're talking about paper, let's go ahead and look up the add-on papers. When you get the add-on papers, you get additional um, an additional sheet each of the vellum and acetate. So there's another sheet of the acetate here. Loving this. Okay, and then you will get an additional sheet of the vellum. All right, and here are the additional papers. So you have this one that's all orchids. All orchids. Nothing but beautiful orchids. And look at that paper on the back side of that. Oh, this would make a lovely card together. These two prints. Oh my gosh, love it. Then you have this one with the file boxes, which I think is so cute. And you can even cut out individual boxes if you wanted to do that as well. And that has that beautiful pink on the back side of that. And then you have this dark background with the orchids, butterflies, and foliage. Beautiful. And that purple that is on the back of that one. So that's the additional papers. Okay. Then we have the additional stickers, which again is another add-on. Let me zoom in so you can get a good look at these. Additional stickers, you will have anywhere from 14 to 18 extra sheets of stickers. And I believe this one has 18. It just depends on how carried away Sammy gets when designing the kit. So I love these little borders here. I love all of this. And there's Renee again as a sticker. And then we have her again. And this is little Renee. So the meaning behind this was, ex again, accepting your true inner self. So it's like embracing who you are from where you, who, or who you were as a child and who you are now. So it's just lovely. And then you have a, all these butterflies on there too. So the message is just heartwarming. Like it's it really, I really get emotional with this kid. Every time I've seen it, I've gotten emotional. I watched someone else's unboxing the other day and I was just almost in tears. Here you have this planner guy and there he is with his little inner self. And this is a bunch of orchids on this sheet. So embracing yourself. I love all of the foliage. Oh my gosh, I just love it. This is so pretty. And then there's some more of the foliage. Look at those ferns. 
I love that. And you have some of the caterpillars and the, what do they call these? The pupas or pupas or something like that. I don't remember quite exactly from geometry, I mean, from biology class. And so we have some let's do this, which would make good headers. And for the week, you've got some laptops, some cameras, some clocks, and some of those storage boxes. And again, those pen cases. That looks like a mouse, a computer mouse. Then we have some quotes. Never hide your true self. Beautiful changes happen in the darkest of times. Eat, sleep, wake up beautiful. Be bold, be brave, be you. What if you fly? You do you. It takes courage to be the real you. Yes. And that is something I've always had to do is be true to myself. And I think that's why this message resonates so well with me. I can't be fake if my life depended on it. Then I would just die. Okay, and I know some people that they put up this persona, persona, they live this fake existence for so long that sometimes I think they are even out of touch with who they really truly are. And I'm glad that my mother raised us to just be true to ourselves. And you don't got to like me, but as long as I'm being true to myself, I'm good. <laughs> and I love this one. And then you became the butterfly I love it so I, I love that message of embracing who you really are you don't have to fit in anybody else's box you fit in your own box okay God made every single one of us unique but yet in his image now tell me how great that is how great that is that we're all made in his image but yet we're still unique in our own person be true to you don't ever try to be like anybody else be you embrace you love you have fun with you because you know what that's going to make you more likable that's going to make you more lovable when you just be yourself i love it here's some flat ladies let me show you those so you have like the um traveler's notebook in the pen case here you have some notebooks and looks like some photos coffee um, some, a top and shorts with little butterfly earrings. I don't know if y'all can see that. <laughs> That's cute. And then you have the headphones and a laptop. So yeah, you get those flat lays. I have been incorporating these more in my spreads and stuff because I wasn't really doing that at first. I was kind of confused at how to use them. But here we have this scene. This is beautiful. It is a double box, okay? It's a double box. And it also has this little strip here for those people that have those um, planners that have the space in between your boxes, like Erin Condren ones, I believe. And that way um, it fits all the way across. Love this. Then some more full boxes at the bottom. Ugh, this. I don't know. I'm going to be reluctant to use this because it is so stunning. With brave wings, you will fly. And look at that. The life cycle again. It's very similar to the, the art card that came in the kit. And then we have another um, set of full boxes. We have the books on the shelving there. And these boxes here that you can actually write in. I just love the, the florals and the the greenery there I love that this color palette is to die for then you get four sets of day covers with some little extras there's always these watercolor splashes um, like a quarter box um, what is that? Um, habit tracker full box she started adding in bullets which I love so you get that in all four colors of the kit these colors are just popping. Goodness. Then you get some, oh, there's the other one, the other fourth one there. Then you get the minis, okay? You get this sheet of like more functional minis. So you see some of them doing laundry, cooking, planning. That one's sick. Um, birthday one, happy mail one, okay. And then you get those peekaboos. And you've got some more peekables up here. And I want you to notice there's Renee 
dancing with her younger self, loving on herself. I love that. And then you get more like that over here. And so there's a little planner guy dancing with his younger self, embracing his younger self. So there's little Renee, big Renee, the little guy, the big guy. And then here again, they're dancing and embracing themselves. I just love that. That, I love that. I love this kit. Like, I love this kit, but that's not a surprise. But yeah, so those are the extra stickers. So that is everything that I got in here, guys. So again, here's my um, additional papers, my additional stickers. Here are my standard papers and my standard stickers. Here is my, let me zoom out so you can see everything. Here is my washi, my die cuts, okay? our stamps, the pen, the quote cards, and the welcome card, and then the mystery gift with the extra sheets of stickers. So that is everything. Again, this kit has everything that I love. It's got the purple. It's got the orchids. It's got the butterflies. Orchids are my second favorite floral. And the message, the message of embracing and loving your true and inner self yeah don't change because others are uncomfortable with who you are that's their problem not yours be true to you I love that message and that's something I've, I've always had to do especially when it comes to this YouTube channel I felt like I my channel could have soared a long time ago if I had done certain things or attached myself to certain people um but that wouldn't have been being true to me so I didn't do that <laughs> I I don't see how people can be comfortable not being true to themselves or being their true self that it's it's not even comfortable it's more work and more effort to try and be something in someone else than just being who you are and so that's why I love, love the message behind this kit. And it's probably going to be up there at the top as one of my favorite planners and on this kits. I say that all the time. This is going to be one of my favorite. But this, it has everything I love and a beautiful message. So, yes. If you are interested in becoming a subscriber to Planners Anonymous, there is a description. I mean, there's a link in the description box that you can uh, click. That link will provide you with um, $10 off your first subscription box. One thing I can tell you, you get a lot for your money. I have been able to use these kits several, several times and not really run out of anything. I just recently used that Sunday roast kit to make a recipe book. And I still have plenty left to use in that kit. I thought I was going to use up everything. I still have so much stuff left. Um, and being a subscriber gets you discounts on Traveler's Notebooks and other non-subscriber items. So definitely click the link below. Get yourself subscribed. You'll love it. Like you will love it. So that is it. Tell me what you love most about this kit. Let me know down below in the comments what resonates to you the most. What do you think about the message behind the kit? <sighs> Are you as taken away emotionally and as emotional as I am about this kit? Because I love it. Um, I really try not to cry during this unboxing because... This kit really does something to me. But yeah, that's it for this video. And you guys know what to do. Be sure to slay, subscribe, like, and accept the alert so you don't miss any videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.